we want to let you know that this is the ministry of Fruitland United Methodist Church and St. Paul's Episcopal Church. Both of these two congregations are very small, and we have an extremely large percentage of the congregation involved in this ministry, as you will be able to see. We rely on the volunteers to help our neighbors. We rely on the scripture that says, love your neighbor as yourself. In these trying times of the virus going on and unemployment rising, that we see our, our ministry of food help very, very necessary. So we hope that everybody's coming uh, today to help uh, have the food go out in the boxes and the extra items that we add to the boxes and then the neighbors put their food supplies into the car themselves so we keep everything at a distance. We rely on everybody who has helped, all the donors. Many donors come and bring eggs, bring vegetables, uh, bring turnip greens, bring collard greens, uh, and apples, of course, when the apple trees are in bloom. We rely on the neighbors who bring in food uh, to help the other neighbors. And so this pantry uh, is sponsored by many other Methodist and Episcopal churches, community foundations, and we are grateful to everybody who lends a hand. As you can see across the street, we're still moving cars in. We've already done over 30 households and we have another 25 cars up on the hill waiting to come over. Because of the boxes per car on the table to put them in and the, the neighbors putting their own uh, the seats into their car, their own boxes into their car, we have a long line and we have two monitors at the highway. And so today, we would like to introduce to those here a representative of the Bishop's Office, uh, Canon Augusta Anderson, and let her say a word about the support that comes from the Bishop's Office. And she's also just taken her mask off so we can hear her. Thank you. So on behalf of Bishop Jose McLaughlin, we are so thrilled by the work of the Edneyville Community Food Pantry, this collaboration between Methodists and Episcopalians. As a diocese, Bishop Jose and others have supported this food pantry ministry by grants as well as on-site support as a way of reaching out to those in need in this particular community. And in particular this week, since it's Holy Week and today being Monday Thursday, a day that we recognize Jesus having his last supper with his friends, we recognize that today as people get bread and they get food to take home to their families, that this is another way that they are enacting without realizing it, the way community is formed around bread and common tables. So we're really excited that even as this virus is slowing other parts of our world and our lives down, that community is found here that we can meet the needs of those on the margins, people that we know that live right next door to us, that are hungry. And so thank you for learning about Edneyville Community Food Pantry.